Neighbors near East Patapsco and St. Victor watched firefighters wash off a sidewalk where a 16-year-old boy was shot. They've seen the teen play games there with his friends many times. He was out here every day, good kid, playing dice. I mean, always said hi, always moved out of your way. Good kid. He didn't do nothing wrong. Sad. It's real sad. She was too afraid to show her face, but the neighbor says she heard gunfire at around 345 and ran out of the house. The kids running and then everybody screaming at the end of the street. Then the boy laying on the sidewalk. The 16-year-old died at a hospital. Investigators don't have any suspects, but they think the case is connected to another shooting two hours earlier <laughs> and just six blocks away. Police say they found two teens, 16 and 18 years old, shot in the 400 block of East Patapsco. One was shot in the hand and arm, the other in the arm and back. Both of them are expected to survive. Detectives put down at least 17 bullet markers and were still at that scene investigating when they got the call about the 16-year-old. Investigators believe that all of the victims were targeted. This is a very, very busy street. This is broad daylight. There are a lot of people outside. Obviously, someone must have saw something. We need those people to come forward. It's unconscionable, really. You can't even let your kids sit on the street and, and play dice on the corner and have to worry that they're going to get shot and killed. A family just lost their child. He'll never come home again. In both cases, police said that they think the suspects and the victims were walking at the time of the shootings, but they're still investigating. Anyone with information about the cases should call Metro Crime Stoppers at 1-866-7-LOCKUP. Live in the studio tonight, Kyrie, WBAL, TV 11 News.